Who can we blame for a unionist getting letters in Irish? Katrina's to blame, isn't she? All over a hurricane. <laughs> <laughs> Different spelling. <laughs> They do, they mangle, they mangle the English language. They're the only people, MLA is the only people can, it's their language they speak and they can still make it sound like their second language. It is astounding how they do it. And these people are paid 40, 50 grand to make speeches, the speeches that are written for them. They are written for them, right? And they just have to, they're handed them and they can read them. And they, she wants to translate it now into Irish. The answers, uh, responses she wants into uh, Irish and English. And then they'll go to the uh, union side and they'll want to translate it into Ulster Scots and then Irish and then back into English just to annoy Katrina. Do you know what I mean? I still see it, they stand up, they stand up to read and their wee hands are going like that. <laughs> Look, we'll do, it, we'll do it. You do the Irish, right? And you do the Ulster Scots, right? No, you do it. Right? <laughs> <laughs> so. It's up and we hands going, we hands going. That's racism, wouldn't you ask Paul to do the Ulster Scots? <laughs> I would like to say to the Assembly that this situation is a situation that can't go on, so I can't so it can't. <laughs> I'll, do, I'll do the sign language. <laughs> <laughs> Falsha Goody and Sinn Féin Ardesh. <laughs> There's a real lot of slobbering going on. <laughs> and if the situation doesn't stay, the situation is going to be a real situation. Thank you, young Cam Corner. <laughs>